Jefferson here. I'm just going to go over um, to show you how I use um, auto hotkey in conjunction with uh, my mouse here to help me with my multi monitor setup. I have like seven, I have like five monitors that I regularly use, and um, it helps that I can switch between monitors with the click of my mouse. So basically, here, if you can see here, this goes, this is like moves the mouse to the right half of the screen and this one moves moves it toward the left right yeah you can kind of see it um, those are the two and then this one right here if I press this button it minimizes and maximizes the window in the current screen and that just helps me uh, it just helps manage the monitors because just because I have so many and it, it beats just dragging it. I mean, also I can hit the caps lock button. That's um, that's a different code that is at the bottom. So I'll show you that one. So I so I hold the caps lock button. I can press anywhere on the window and it moves it around. But usually I use the this these buttons on this uh, G G700 mouse, which I highly recommend. I'll I'll put that in the link so you can see where you can get it for cheap. Um, so first off, in terms of the gaming mouse itself, the G500, what I do is I just assign the button here. So left windows, right, or double click it. And then I just set it up as a keystroke. So I do left windows and the right. And then the other one, I do left windows and left. And then the middle one, what I do is I set it as left, control alt equal sign. Um, and the reason why I set that, this, this middle one that I'm pointing out on uh, the mouse here is because that's the one I set up on auto hotkey. Sorry, so all right. So what this is the code that I use for auto hotkey to um, to do it. So remember, I said Control Alt and then the equal sign, and then that that this code right here is the code I use that will maximize and minimize the window in that current screen. Um, I'll, I'll paste it in the description as well so you can just copy and paste it. I think I got this code from way back when, I, I don't remember. Um, and then the other major one is you just hold caps lock and then it moves the window. If you want that one, Actually, I don't really use this one, but I'll, I'll copy and paste this code for you as well. Um, this is pretty much it. Uh, I got it copied from somewhere else on Auto Hotkey. I'm not sure where, but um, I'll put that in there as well. So anyway, uh, yeah, you just put that in your Auto Hotkey stuff. I'm not going to do a tutorial on Auto Hotkey. This is assuming you already know how to use it, um, and that's pretty much it. All right, have a good one.